<laughs> this is the second heating, making it black. Here, then you'd have to reheat it before yes. you dipped it. Yes. Okay. It's pretty so. warm. It's kicking out a lot of heat. Yeah. That's what the copper does. So yeah, what we want to do is we want, we want to heat this, right? Yep. Okay. That's just a, a heavy borax solution, just regular plain old boxed borax. 20 mule teams. The 20 mule teams. 20 mule team borax. Yes, the old one. Mm -hmm. Then you just rinse it off real good in cold water and rub it with your fingers. And so you can do it till the black stuff is completely well, caked in there. Yeah. It's close enough. I mean, that's a good semiconductor right there. So it's really the reddish part that you want. Right in here, yeah. That's what you want to show up as a red. Mm -hmm. It was nothing! It was an empty box with a plug on it! <laughs> And what type of copper? Just copper, regular copper. I mean the the red. What's the distinction between the corpus copper? Corpus copper is the red one. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. See, this will be be fine. <clears throat> Here, Chuck, go see. I can do that. Just light. Alum and water? Alum and distilled water. Yeah. And it's got to be the aluminum? The aluminum? Yes. Yeah. Alu yeah. Pickling alum. It's a, yeah. The thing about magnesium. Aluminum, yeah. ammonium. If you have any galvanic action, that's what you get. Right. See? Right. But when you don't have the galvanic action. Alum and water. that a little more. So it's just regular paper towel? Yeah. So he's going to put the alum down in there. No, no that's a coffee filter. Yeah. That well, is this is a paper towel. Oh, I paper didn't towel. use the coffee filter. And that's just a pure magnesium. Mm -hmm. We're going to push this down. Hey, Chuck. There you go. You know, we're going to get our goo here. That's more alum? Yeah. Yeah. We don't want to waste it. I mean, right. 50 pounds of it. <laughs> <laughs> want some? <laughs> Cheaper than buying it at Walmart. Is 250 for uh, 50 pounds we got for how much was it? For? Um, it was about $50, but it was $50 in shipping. Yeah. Okay. Got so. It. So that oh, alum will bind yeah, but that's like still two bucks a pound. pretty pasty like that when you got Yeah, when it's up. Well, no, no, if you go look at those copper bowls where right. the FM the FM transmitter is <laughs> running right now. Uh -huh. As long as you don't when you let it when you set this yeah, will start to crystallize and form cavities in it. And they'll actually hold the water in them. Okay, now since the outside of the cup is semiconductive, you have to scrape through that with the quick wick. Right. Where you're going to clip that. It's like an insulator. Uh -huh. Otherwise, you've got to die on it. Or you can it's clean it really good right, and use the, a yeah. tinning solution, and then you can solder a wire to it as well. So we're going to let it just build an elm because I know so. Right. Does that water have to be distilled or anything? Or just yes. tap water? Just distilled. Just distilled. Just distilled with alum. Distilled with alum in it. You use elm water and an elm battery. So that's why rain should work fine. Yeah. If it's You're going to edit all this? Oh, no. This is Raw and director's cut. Director's cut. Director's cut. <laughs> director's cut. Yeah. With all the words. Here's what I've got to do for this guy. So you're just going to stand the spot to put a clip? Yep.
John was having trouble with that yellow clip lead there. It was not, not a good connection or something. Yeah, yeah, if you wiggle it over there on the light, he was playing around with that and it lit up. Then let's hook it up the correct direction. So the magnesium is negative and the copper is positive? Correct. <clears throat> copper is a positive gate on it. Well, it's over 30 milliamps right now. That's pretty good. It's over 30 milliamps and it's really bright. bright. You know? <laughs> Let me go get a decent. <laughs> uh, decent, decent. Is pegging the meter? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Those things are bright. Here's little copper magnesium alum batteries powering this radio transmitter. There's a broadcast antenna. The only copper magnesium alum powered radio station. <laughs>